Hey YouTube, it's Kim from Our Simple Life. I'm going to show you guys today how to make your own all-purpose cleaner. It works really good for the kitchen, counters, sinks, all that good stuff, and it works pretty darn good in the bathroom too. Um, it'll save you some money because you'll probably have these ingredients if you make your own laundry soap, like the borax, and while well, we all have vinegar laying around the house, right? Okay. Uh, it takes water and just soap. That's it. Um, it saves on having a whole lot of bottles shoved under your kitchen sink too that are specific for a million different jobs. This will do just about everything. And it's nice and gentle and safe. Alright, now I'm going to use a 32, I don't know if you guys can see that, I'm going to use a 32 ounce bottle. It's just an empty bottle. Um, I have already put in my quarter of a cup, one quarter cup of dish soap. I don't care what kind, it doesn't make a darn bit of difference, whatever you like to use. Now, you're also going to need, I'm going to see if I can do this in one hand, ha ha ha. Okay, you're going to need how much vinegar? You need six tablespoons of white vinegar. Okay, here we go. Is it going to stay up? Let's find out. Yay! Okay, done. Then you need three teaspoons of borax that stuff okay six tablespoons this is going to make about three cups of solution so adjust it if your bottle's bigger or smaller da -da -da -da. okay done now the only thing you need left is three cups of hot water it's important that it's hot it helps dissolve the borax pour that in without making a mess Yay! Okay. Oops. It's getting bubbly. Calm down a little bit. Okay, my bubbles have calmed down, so I'm going to pour the rest of this in here. Just a little bit left. There we go. Oh, wow, that was it? Okay. So anyway, <laughs> now that that's all mixed up, you're going to put your bottle back together. Just give it a real gentle shake. Don't go nuts. And let the water inside cool down. Um, the last time I made this, I didn't let the water cool down. And I had a hard time using, I had a hard time getting it to come out of the spray nozzle. After it cooled down, I used it, and it was totally fine. So try that. And um, yeah, so that's it. Homemade all-purpose cleaner and it didn't cost me anything and it works really really good and I hope it works for you okay guys and we'll see you soon bye